Valentina Gillis, the number one seed from Belgium, taking on Frida Mohamed, the number three seed from Egypt. Seven three might uh, come to the races yet. The Belgian, perhaps a little bit flat. And out six nine. It's a pattern that Farida Mohammed played into against Alvis so many times yesterday. If, it, if that was me, it would be like a like a real red flag, be a gaping hole in the. Well, I mean, they've the been the What they have is Muhammad. an unbelievable facility Muhammad in the form of squash TV. Better. Ten, six, so now it's Gillis that's attacking ten, the front of the court. Every opportunity. Much better second game here from the number one seed. Not up. Eleven six game to Gillis. One game all. Just could not get enough height on some of those lobs for Killis. Eight all. Yeah. Beautiful no touch. Lead. Beautiful touch. I would be more wary to keep the ball away from that forehand side of Mohammed. Poses all. such a threat there. So game ball for Mohammed. Thirteen eleven, game to Mohammed. Mohammed leads two games to one. The speed and the intensity that's increased in the women's game, but you can also can't beat the counteracting of that. Three love, which we're seeing here. Far off the back wall, not allowing Mohammed to take in that favourite shot of hers, the forehand kill. Hand out two eight. It's the length. Beautiful finish. And it was the length that did the damage, damage for Tina Gillis. Well, Frida Mohammed with a self inflicted injury. I'm not sure where that would have happened there, PJ, but. She's only got 60 seconds left of that allotted time. I know she's got the big strapping on that leg of hers, which she's had for a good few weeks since the Tournament of Champions just before then. Beautiful finish. Ball is fine, pickups are good. Stroke to Mohammed. You're in a swing. You're in a swing. Stroke. You're right in a swing, Miss Gillis. On the verge of a biggest title win. The young Egyptian. And she's done it. 11 5. Match to Mohammed. Three games to two. So Frida Mohammed takes 11, the. 6, six 11, Championship 13, 11, here. It's the biggest win 6, for 11, the 20 year 11, old. 5.
51 minutes, 3-2 victory for Farida Mohamed, the number three seed, to take her biggest title to date on the PSA World Tour, this 30K PSA Challenger status event. I mean, two days before this tournament, I was gonna pull out because of my injury. So um, my coaches were by my side and I just want to thank everyone, my coaches and my parents, my sister and everyone who came today. And every day, actually, it felt amazing of course to play in front of everyone. Thanks to Greg and Colleen. Congrats on an amazing career. Thanks to Lee Bitchell. Thanks to everyone. Thanks to the organizers, promoters. Thanks to you. Thanks to everyone. And I'm just so happy with my week. And it's a great way to end the season.